All right, don't make this more complicated than it is. Come on. Now, this is the last time this is happening, right? Because next time Hannah's doing it. I can't do this anymore. You know, that's funny. They thought you had a club foot. You know, but you're broken. It's okay. We love you. The whole family loves you. Ooh, bush. <laughs> you're doing so great. Look how great you're walking with your little splint. Now I better not come off anymore. This is my bike. It's a Le Mans, and as you can see, it's made of 853 Reynolds steel. That's uh, about it about my bike. Lord Byron, aren't you thirsty? We need you to stay hydrated too. You know, water has a lot of benefits for your body. It's good to stay hydrated. Right, bud? Okay, now let's go get some exercise. Come on. Come on, Lord Byron. Little Byron, you're so cute. Dr. Cannon? Sarah Haddo? What brings you around here? I was on my way to school. On the way to school? Yeah. What you doing? You going to teach some cardio? Definitely. Well, I'm actually really happy I ran into you because I have a physiology question that you can help me out with right up your alley. So I wanted to know how the blood flows through the heart. Well, the pressure gradient and oh, I have some chest pain. Chest pain? Yeah, it's substernal. Substernal? Oh no. Let's go to the PA classroom. I'll drive. Okay. All right, Dr. Cannon, we're on the way to school, okay? I'm gonna try to get comfortable. Okay. Oh, that's worse. Uh, Don't make it worse. Oh, that's better. If I lean forward. It's making it feel better when you lean forward? Well yes. then stay forward, we're almost there. Okay. Uh-oh, watch out, Van. Lord Byron's doing pretty good. You know, he, he messes up sometimes and he gets kind of angry with his splint. So I just, I just give him one of these puppies and it just makes them feel all better. Oh no, gotta keep my hands on the road. Oh. You know, I'm just trying to keep your mind off of it, off your chest pain. Uh, thank you for bringing me in. You're welcome. Okay, well, we're almost there. Oh, okay, stopped at a red light. Well, you know, so if you've seen my button here, did you, have you seen it? No, oh, I didn't realize. Well, you know, so I got kind of irritated about how much money I spent in Atlanta this past weekend. You know, I wanted to go celebrate and I went, we went to the American Girl doll place and I just, I frequent that place too. Yeah. You've you been to that place? Oh yeah, yeah. I love it. You like those dolls too? Okay. And so I decided to wear Joe today instead of Hannah, but don't tell her anyone. I still got Hannah on the back. Oh, yeah. Oh, green. All right. Now keep leaning forward. Keep leaning forward. Oh. All right. Now we probably need to run an EKG. We probably need to, you know, I need to listen to your heart. You know, I was a cardiology PA once, so I know what I'm doing. Yeah. Hey, Allie. You did what? You were running track. Where's your inhaler? Where's your blue inhaler, Allie? Okay, I, I don't have time for this, but I have wonderful news. You got accepted to Davidson. Oh my gosh. Oh my gosh. I know, I know. Hold on, hold on, let me call you back, let me call you back. My child's calling up. Hi, Ellie. Dr. Elam, Dr. Elam. Dr. Cannon's sick. His heart's hurting. Go get oh him. Oh my gosh, let me help. Let me help. Oh, I need to sit down. Okay, well, let's try to get you some place to sit. Okay, right here? Right here. If this is where you want to go. Oh, maybe we should it's get inside. Dirty. Are you sure? Uh, we'll go inside. Okay, okay. Let's, okay. Let's I think go. I let's can go. make it. I got sharp chest pain. It's sharp and I feel like I might have a fever. A fever? Uh-oh. Uh, Let's go to the PA room. Oh. Is it worse with breathing? Yeah. I can't breathe too well. Just breathe as well as you can right now, okay? Oh, you got it, champ. Just pull it together. So 
tell me about Venus and I heard Allie got in. Oh my gosh, Allie's so amazing. She's so artistic. Girl, I was screaming and crying and praising Jesus all night. It was uh it was, it was it was amazing. It's like, I just I don't I don't even know how to feel right now. Oh my gosh, that's so exciting. I mean, you know, the exciting thing that happened to me this weekend yeah. was my chicken slid some eggs, you oh know? Oh my gosh, how did okay. that go? You know, Hannah was so happy and then she asked me where babies were coming from and Ask me how that happened, and I don't want to go down that street, so. That's a bit much. All right, right Dr. Green, right, you right. okay? Uh, okay. Right. How you feeling? How you feeling? It feels better finally forward. Uh, I feel like I have, uh, my fever's getting worse. Can you take my temperature? I can, I can. Okay. That's my safety helmet. You don't need to take your helmet right now. Oh, okay. Okay, Dr. Cannon. Here you go. Let me put this in. Take your temperature. Hold it with your mouth. All right, Lord Byron's gonna help you. It's gonna make you feel more comfortable, okay? Mm -hmm. Isn't he so cute? I know, and his splint has just done so well today. Oh. Okay. Oh no, 101. Oh. oh my god. You have a fever. Dr. Elam, go get my stethoscope. Adam has it. I'm gonna see okay, if he has a rub. Adam, Adam, come here, come here. Head on you. Okay, let's go. We gotta go underneath your clothes and listen on the skin. Lord Byron, help me. Oh no, I think I hear a friction rub. Is it A, an MI, B, pericarditis, or C, a pleural effusion? I got these clickers right here. I'm not ready for this. Thank you. Oh no, Dr. Cannon, they're not working. Uh. Did we still got two more people that haven't rung in yet. Did you change the Five batteries? more seconds. I changed the batteries this morning. Every, all of them should be working. On the results, only 26.8% Hey guys, let's take a selfie! B. I need my safety helmet. Oh. One, two, three. Okay, Dr. Cannon, now that I've listened to your heart, I've got a couple of labs and some imaging I want to do on you, okay? But since this little nugget kept me up all night last night, I wrote them down so I wouldn't miss anything, okay? So what we're going to get, we're going to get an EKG, we're going to get a chest x-ray, we're going to get a CBC, a CMP, an echocardiogram, and we're going to get cardiac enzymes to check if you have a heart attack or are having a heart attack, okay? Make sense? Yes. All right, let's do this. Okay. Hey, Joe Cannon. Hi. Got your results with Lord Byron. Okay, so your CBC was inconclusive. Your um, your CMP also didn't show any abnormalities. Your chest X-ray did show the water bottle sign and the fat pad sign. Your cardiac enzymes weren't out of whack. Um, your um, echocardiogram did show some inflammation. But your um, EKG, I couldn't interpret very well. So I need to go find Ms. Rowe and we need to figure out what's going on, okay? Okay. Is this thing on? I need a Red Bull. Please let this be a normal field trip with a friend. No. Hey, Dr. Elam, let's go get Ms. Rowe. Dr. Cannon, I'm gonna leave my precious Lord Byron here. Watch him take care of him. Don't let him fall off the table. So, you know, pharmacies, EKGs aren't my thing. I wish that I just understood them more. It's a Will you guys close all those doors before no, we get no, started? No, we don't know who's going to try to come in here. No, no. How did Dr. Elon and Ms. Haddle get locked out? Hi, what's wrong? Ms. Rowe, Ms. Rowe, we need you. We need you to read Dr. Cannon's EKG. Come okay, on. come with us. Okay. Okay, here you go, Ms. Wright. Here's his EKG. What you think? Okay, so his EKG has a widespread ST elevation in every lead except for three in AVR. Uh, there aren't any reciprocal changes. There's no pathological Q waves. So usually this indicates pericarditis, actually. Um, how are his cardiac enzymes? They're within normal limits. Okay, so that would rule out a myocardial infarction. So that would confirm the, or it would, I guess, indicate the pericarditis might be his diagnosis. 
So okay. that's what I'll go with. Okay. Um, yeah. While I'm here, did you get my email, either of you, about the faculty meeting tomorrow? Wait, the one that said read yeah. entire email? Yeah. Did you read it entirely? Well, you know, I get like thousands of emails every day. So, okay. no, I didn't. But there's a faculty meeting? Yes, there's one tomorrow. Are you going to be there? Is it during lunch hour? It is. Well, I forgot to pack my lunch today. Uh, <laughs> I guess I, I read the email. You read? I, I, I read it. You'll be there? Yes, I'll be there. Okay. I just won't eat then. That's fine. Okay. All right, guys. I'm going to go back to class now. Um, good luck with Dr. Cannon. I hope he gets better soon. With you, Ms. Road, anything's possible. Thanks, Dr. Elam. You're welcome. All right. <laughs> Thank you. All right, Dr. Cannon, now we're going to look at your x-ray results, all right? Dr. Elam, can you do you mind hitting the x-ray light board for me? Sure. I'm going to go hit the lights. All right, Dr. Cannon, if you can see here, we have the water bottle sign. And over here is our echo. Okay, Dr. Cannon, based on all of your lab results and all of your imaging studies, I think I'm going to have to diagnose you with pericarditis. Questions? What about my pain? Well, it's typically treated with NSAIDs, so like Aleve, ibuprofen, naproxen. Wait a second. It's called NSAIDs, not NSAIDs. Definitely NSAIDs. Tomato, tomato. <laughs> Either way. Have you had any, have you had a past medical history of any ulcers or any GI complications? No. Not that you know of? No. Okay. I'm sure we can get you something off $4 list. That'd be good. That'd be good. Let's get it started in here. Let's get it started. Ha. All right, Dr. Cannon, we're going to get you that prescription, all right? And then we'll send you on home. Hope you feel better. Oh, thank you so much for your help. Dr. Cannon, hey, hi Sarah, hi Alicia. Are you feeling okay? Uh, Are you feeling better? I'm getting I there. I thought you were sick. Yeah, uh, a lot of chest pain. Oh, okay. Do you know what will make you feel better? What's that? A dance party. You have to go under the clothing because you're not supposed to do it on skin. A, myocardial infarction, B, pericarditis, or C, costo... <laughs> and all of your diet. <clears throat> Do you think we could get something along the lines of, uh, <laughs> well, it's typically, uh, <laughs> Dr. Cannon, hi Sarah, Dr. Cannon, hi Alicia, Dr. Cannon, <laughs> okay, <laughs> are you sick, are you okay? Uh, I think so. Yeah? Yeah. Okay, well you know what will make you feel better? What's that? Everybody, <laughs> <laughs>